Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we will be talking about an incredible opportunity for young innovators and problem solvers in India. The Smart India Hackathon or SIH for short. This is one of the largest open innovation models in the world, providing students with a unique platform to showcase their skills and creativity by solving real world problems. Whether you are a tech enthusiast, an engineering student or someone looking to contribute to societal challenges, SIH is the perfect chance for you to shine. Let's dive into the details of this amaz amazing initiative. So this is my channel. Before we proceed, I'd like to tell you that subscribe to my channel because you will be getting a lot of videos related to this type of hackathons um, and the free courses. Now, job opportunities everything here in this particular uh, playlist you can go ahead and watch this this is specifically for the uh, for the students okay so let me just proceed um, so smart india hackathon this is actually the um, uh, this is actually the home page okay so you can find the link in the comment section the pinned comment section so you can see here that the last date for submission here is what um a uh, 20th of september okay so here you can see it's 20th of september and this is the last date okay so if you didn't start it please go and start now because it's uh, it's time to start so just scroll down you can see you can learn more about what is this sih and what are the various things what is the timeline and everything so here i can tell you that um, you can find some problems like you can you will get some ideas here okay so here you can see the problem statement for sih 24 is live okay so just click here it will take you to the thing so what is this actually this is actually a nationwide initiative to provide students with a platform to solve some of the pressing problems faced by the government department ministries industries and various sectors this is actually launched in 2017 and it aims aims is to promote uh, innovation and entrepreneurship foster collaboration between educational institutions and the industry so here they have two main formats one is a software and another one is a hardware so software focuses on providing solutions using digital technology participants are tasked with building software applications to solve issues across domain like health agriculture environment education and more and if you take a hardware so this is like participants are required to design and develop innovative hardware solutions that have the real world applications such as iot based devices agriculture machinery and healthcare equipment each edition has its own challenges and teams must work under tight deadlines to come up with the viable solutions so here you can see uh, here this is a view problem statements so you can just click on uh, this particular student innovation okay so you, if you just click on the student innovation you can find what are the innovations which are uh, submitted by the students i'm not asking you to copy this okay so this is what they expect okay those these are all the problem statements they are looking for okay so you can see here that the student innovation it's a hardware and you can see the smart education just click on this particular student innovation you can see what is actually the problem details a smart education a concept describes learning in digital age it enables learner to learn more effectively efficient flexible and more easily likewise you can just go ahead and click on this uh, so this is the description creating intelligent devices and what you're going to submit okay so here you can see these are all the problem statements they are looking for so for first this particular problem statement no sum no idea has been submitted so far okay and if you take some other problem like um, student innovation hardware this is the description there is a need of design drones and robots that can solve some of the pressing challenges of India such as handling medical emergencies, search and rescue operations etc. For this, for 5 ideas has been submitted so far. So what is idea is you have to select idea such, such that those idea has not submitted so far. Okay, we have still we have nearly 10 more days to go. So uh, you can definitely think about it if you are joining as a group. Okay, so you can see some of the information about this particular um, a particular thing here okay so implementation team and if you just go ahead they have given you a, 
uh, template in order to do this okay so what is the problem statement you're planning to do this is what you're going to submit it what is the problem statement title theme ps category like software or hardware what is the team id and what is the team name before this this is what actually this is how you want to present it okay during the hackathon final uh, final uh, temp deck template you have to submit your hackathon right so simply you can just see here there is a, a, a login and register option on the top which is available okay so you have to click here um, okay so you have to click here it will ask you to register you have to submit your registration first you, you have to register as your as a, um, uh, as an individual so you have to give your email id password what is the role whether you're college institute or evaluator or the team leader whatever you have to give this submit it okay so your uh, um, credentials will be created and then try to enroll in this and once you have submitted any of your idea you will be getting all these uh, information okay like team id what is the team id what is the team name uh, which you have registered in the portal and everything so the thing which you have to be ready is what what you're going to do like whether you have to go ahead with the software or the hardware okay so the participants why should you participate because you will be working on actual problems that industry and government departments are facing which will definitely give you a practical experience and throughout the hackathon you will receive a guidance from industry experts mentors and government officials to refine your solution and SIH offers lucrative cash prizes for the best solution beyond that it, it is a chance to have your solution recognized at a national level possibly even implemented by the government or industry so many participants of SIH have gone um, like or gone on to a secure internship and jobs through their association with the hackathon it's a great networking opportunity as well okay so first you have to form a team with like-minded uh, students from your institution the team should have typically six members with at least one female participation where uh, participants where it will give you a uh, uh, like you are uh, uh, equally getting the teams like from the equal gender you're getting the team okay so next is you have to choose a problem statement you can browse the problem statement here as i told you can just click on this problem statement and see for which problem there is no nothing has been submitted yet go to the student okay and you can even uh, you can even uh, config like you can even filter here okay just select the student here and then you have to uh, go ahead with the theme you can select the team which theme you want okay agriculture or blockchain uh, clean or green fitness sports what you you want okay smart education if you want to go ahead with the smart education click that and then what is the category you want to go with the hardware or the software and the next one is which organization is looking for this you can find what the organizations which are looking for such a uh, uh, solution for the problem they have so this is what so once you have selected the problem you have to submit a detailed solution idea online through the sih portal that is what once you click login they will definitely ask you what you just wanted to go ahead with okay okay you have to register as a new spoc where they'll be asking you the uh, uh, code so you can get the help from your institution okay and Inst you have to get the institution code you have to enter that here and everything your faculty name who is going to help you and the email id mobile number everything you have to give here and uh, you have to upload the consent letter the, so this is very important so this letter format you can get it from here like the consent uh, letter format which is available here in the uh, in the portal itself okay so you can download that get the letter and upload it and the register you have to register for the uh, for the um, SIH okay so this is what so just uh, talk to your uh, HOD or your uh, uh, your teacher your professor or whomsoever is directly ready to guide you so you have to actually uh, uh, enroll you have to enroll as a day, uh, university or the college student uh, so you have to upload it okay so this is what so, so the smart India hackathon utilize this so the grand finale of SIH is the highlight of the hackathon so this will be a uh, uh, selected teams will work continuously over a period okay so they'll be working over a period of time and 
you can definitely do it okay just uh, uh, try to talk to your uh, uh, so here you can see this is sih registration so try to go ahead and uh, register okay so this is what i want so that you have it it is a complete overview of the smart india hackathon and why you should consider participating so if you are someone with a passion for loving problems and making a difference in society this is your chance to set up innovate and leave a lasting impact make sure you visit this particular uh, website and you will be getting lot of information about this just go through talk to your uh, college if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more content like this comment below if you have any questions or if you are planning to participate in sih i'd love to hear from you thank you so much for watching and good luck to all the future innovate, uh, innovators out there Thank you take care bye bye and if you have any queries you can just connect with me here the link is in the description schedule a call with me i'll be there to help you out thank you take care and bye bye have a great day ahead